If you want to get in contact with me, the best way to do it is on Instagram. If you just want to say what up, if you want to tell me you love my videos, you can tell me that you hate my videos, but the best way to do that is on Instagram. Peace, y'all. Johnny Fastlane here. So, Nicki Minaj's husband gets confined to 120 days of house arrest. Let's talk hip hop. Thanks, y'all. It's your boy Johnny Fastlane here. So this situation is crazy, man, because Nicki Minaj's husband um, gets put on 120 days of house arrest, right? I mean, you guys know the whole situation, man. He is a registered sex offender. He's also a convicted murderer. He went to jail for manslaughter and he went to jail for rape, right? Two different times, two different things, but both of those things did happen years ago. One in the 90s, one in like the early 2000s, right? Um, it's 2023, so both of them happened like, let's say, 20 20 years ago, right? Either way, Nicki Minaj married him and he has to register as a sex offender. But the crazy thing is that you guys know, man, Nicki Minaj and Cardi B, they've been beefing for a while, right? It seems like Kenneth Petty, Nicki Minaj's husband, jumped into, you know, Cardi B's DMs or, you know, threatened Cardi B on the internet. So Offset messaged Kenneth Petty, like, where you at? You're not finna disrespect my wife. Um, and that's when Kenneth Petty, right after the VMAs, because you know Nicki Minaj was hosting, Kenneth Petty actually did a video threatening Offset saying that he's gonna see him, right? I mean, it's crazy as hell because he's a registered sex offender and he is on probation. Um, So, of course, now his probation officer says, nah, you're not gonna be threatening no individuals while you're on the internet and you were in presence of somebody else who was a felon, you're getting 120 days of home confinement, right? Um, Which is crazy as hell. So when that news came out today, of course, a lot of Nicki Minaj fans were saying that Offset told on uh, Kenneth Petty or that Cardi B told on Kenneth Petty, right? Um, Nicki Minaj even went on her Insta story to insinuate that Offset's album flopped, so that's why he told on Kenneth Petty, right? Um, crazy as hell. Then, of course, Jason Lee came out and he actually said that Nicki Minaj's husband tried to hire some people to threaten him as well, right? Um, so the whole situation is wild and it seems like the only person that's really getting in trouble behind any of this, like, by the law um, is Kenneth Petty because he got paperwork on him already, right? Um, everybody else is just trading shots on the internet. They probably will never see each other. They've been doing this for years, um, but that man is risking his freedom for Nicki Minaj, right? Um, the whole situation is wild and that's what's going on for now, but um, yeah, let me know what y'all think about this in the comments.